Hi, my name is Rom Levi. I'm French, I come from Paris. I currently live in Dubai where I run Valerie Gallery. The gallery space was established about two years ago now. Uh, it is currently the highest gallery in the world. And it was made in an effort to kind of establish Dubai as a leading city in the contemporary art and to bring some of my favorite artists that I was used to see in Hong Kong, London or New York into the city and to broaden the scope of culture of Dubai. I got involved with art and street art quite by mistake actually. Well, I don't know if I can call it a mistake, but quite by chance. I was walking to school every day in Paris when I was around 14, 15 years old. And at some point I was crossing an area which is called La Butte Basically, this area in Paris was one of the first with street art and uh, stencils, invader. We were talking around maybe 96, 97. And it became the favorite moment of my day. Walking to school, I was looking into discovering what's new in the city, discovering what's new in the streets. And it's really my first memories of appreciation of art. Later on, as my passion grew and as I got a bit older, I started to spend more and more time looking into urban art. And one day I decided to create a website because I was spending so much time looking into it and that it might save some time for some guy on the other side of the globe. And if I can send someone three out, I might as well compile everything. Well, I compiled everything and I created Street Art News, which quickly became like one of the leading websites in the world for daily news about street culture and urban art. And that's how I got involved into art, thanks to the website. And artists started to contact me, galleries, and little by little I started to understand how things work and I decided to try it out by myself. Definitely when someone buys an artwork from me, and this is true since I've been selling art, which is around 15 years now, they buy way more than just an artwork. Obviously there is a primary layer, which is something beautiful to put in your home, in your house, to enjoy with your friends. But most importantly, as the famous French emperor said, Napoleon, Art is kind of like human memory. You're really buying a piece of someone's memories. You can relate to the work. You can be close, like the ones I have behind, and look at how the artist did. You can see his brush stroke. You can see his presence in the artwork. So when you buy art, you buy more than just a painting. You buy memories, and that's why art is priceless.